Good morning, sir. I'm Siddharth Singh, and before I start my interview, I would like to say that I'm really thankful to you for giving me time, and this will be highly helpful for me. Um, that's okay, Siddharth. Uh, it's a pleasure meeting you on this call. Thank you. Same goes to you. Okay, so. uh first i would like to ask uh one second uh, okay so first of all i would like to ask what exactly does it feel like to be a ceo well as being a ceo is a position of great responsibility not only you have to look around to ensure that your company is doing well uh of uh, in terms of meeting its objectives doing financially well and uh, growing as part of the plan which every company has but you also have to ensure that the well being of your uh, teammates your employees and other things related to the people who form the team are taken care of in addition to that it is also important to see that we are also making a great uh, social contribution both in terms of uh, uh, doing the value add which we are providing to the mobility industry and at the same point of time doing things in society around us so as to uplift uh, people in our neighboring uh, areas so so i think overall it's a it's a job of a very very high uh, set of responsibilities and uh, therefore uh, it's challenging but at the same point of time pretty interesting as well okay now the second question would be uh, do you have any message for the ceos for young student like a message well, for young students to aspire like what it feels like or aspire aspire to become a ceo yeah if you are aspiring to become a ceo then obviously you have to have certain traits which you should be practicing uh, right now uh, it it takes lot of hard work there is no shortcut for becoming a ceo you need, it 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 takes lot of hard work to get to the position because you need a, a lot of experience you need lot of patience and you need a lot of knowledge to to get on to that position of uh, importance a uh, second uh, aspect is two two things which i consider very critical for anybody who is aspiring to become a ceo the first is having a sense of discipline self discipline as one would say you need to follow a regime which is uh, which you need to plan well and ensure that you're for, you, you're doing things as per the plan which you have laid down uh, and and this plan has to be uh, you know reviewed regularly and ensured that whatever you planned has got completed or not in case not then how can you kind of fit in with all your other works so as to ensure that you come back on track so that's the first thing uh uh the the second aspect obviously is uh also uh, to to uh be in a state where you are well aware of what is happening around you which means you have to read a lot you have to uh meet a lot of people and get experiences from them uh you have to understand what's happening in the economy you have to understand what is happening in society you will need to understand what your consumers are thinking what your end customers are thinking your employees are thinking so it is very important to be updated with whatever is happening around you inside the country in your factory area in the world in the global economy and so on so forth so you have to be well read and you have to be a very discipline oriented person okay i think that would be all once again thank you so much for giving me time i really appreciate it you you are most welcome sir thank you so much thank you so much see you